I don't fear anybody. I don't fear racing anybody. I don't worry about racing anybody. I mean, I respect my competition. And I know they're all very talented, but I feel like I'm, I'm in the same class as they are, and we're all there together. And I can win, they can win, anybody can win. I wake up every morning and go to practice. That's what they do. What's the difference? During my childhood, I was fast. I was faster than a lot of the kids. I didn't dominate physically because I've always been quite slender, but I but I did dominate in speed of speed games, like so track or soccer or anything that required speed. Uh, I still remember being, you know, eight nine years old and telling my mom that I wanted to go to the Olympics and telling my mom, oh, I'm going to make the Olympics. I'm going to I'm going to run at World Championships one day. I'm going to do things. And her telling me, absolutely you are. I know you are. You know, no question about it. I will never forget what it feels like to be flat, flat broke. I will never forget, it's, it's just a feeling you will never forget. And I'll never forget what it feels like to not be able to eat. And you know, growing up, like, like you know, we, we really didn't have any money. I mean, we always had happiness. We were always happy. We were always a laughing, loving family. You know, we, we owe that, a lot of that to my mom, you know? She raised us, she always put us first, you know, and, and worked very, very hard. Still, we're hardest worker I know by far. I didn't know what I really wanted to do. I was a 400 meter runner for a while. I had long jump, triple jump, I had done long distance, I had done decathlons, I had done a lot of different things. A lot of different experimenting until I found the right niche kind of deal. Well, the 800 fascinated me because it was the first time I really paid attention to the fact that it, there's tactics involved and quick thinking. And I like that. And there you see Gary Reed trying to move up with the leaders, trying to keep pace with the front runners. You know what I mean? It was exciting for me, to, the, the, the jostling and the, the, you know, anything could happen. But I like that, you know? I mean, sometimes it works against me, sometimes it works for me. But I like the, the fact that the, op the opportunity is there. I want to be the guy who can handle any pace, who can go off a slow pace, a fast pace, a medium pace, an awkward race, a weird race, and always be in it. For athletes who do the same event from nine years old to when they're 21 years old, are probably a little bit more burnt out than they think, which is why I say I was really glad to find the event so late because I have, I've had all this motivation and all this uh, desire to really want to be one of the best. And so I wouldn't say I'm a natural. I'm a, I'd say I'm a, I'm a hard worker. There's no substitute for hard work. There just isn't, you know? And, and it's, it's once, once you get to where you want to get to in life, you, you gotta fight like hell to stay there.